how does this happen all your life? You think the space you got is not enough. And then you open your closet door and think, my life must be more than the sum of this stuff. Something moves you from within, like say your boyfriend moving in. And that's how you begin to let things go. You look up at that shelf and you tell yourself to let things go. And next thing you know, you are standing amidst your whole entire history and you're strewing it across the floor. You got out of day planners and dog-eared postcards and think what in God's name was I keeping these for? Packed in boxes just in case, but now I really need the space. So I'm gonna clean this place and let things go. I'm determined to clear out some room in here and let things go. Plastic souvenirs, why look, I've got some birthday cards, a pamphlet on Van Gogh. Should have done this years ago, but somehow I've been petrified to see what's been kept inside these chests and drawers. It's so very strange finding stuff from a lifetime ago. Even when the life you find is yours Cause there are things that make you feel Like you need this proof your past was real And you can't let them go So back into boxes they go how does this happen? You tear up your apartment just to put it back together again. Jason will be fine. We'll get creative with our space so that all of our things fit together. And then my whole life can stay in there, though he's got to put his shoes somewhere. Why can't I be some other Claire who can just let things go? I mean, I said I would try, and I did, but I can't let things go. Oh, you know, Martha Stewart, I'm not her. I'm gonna let things go back where.